Hey guys, in this video I'm going to compare the screens of these two smartphones. We have the Galaxy Note 4 versus the um, Galaxy Grand Prime. Then we have the Samsung Galaxy S5, the Octa-Core, the Octa-Core, and the Quad-Core. This is 64-bit, and these, both of these devices are 32-bit. So, you can see this is the newest device. And uh, I want to compare the screens of these three devices uh, just to show you the difference between the AMOLED screens and the TFT screens you know the difference the colors and all kind of stuff so uh, of course let's try to have maximum brightness on all the devices okay let's have some lower down the brightness here a bit more So let's compare it with opening up the Android wallpaper that we get, Android picture, about device, and uh, Android 4.4.4, hit cat. So first you can see that you can see that the Nexus 5, I mean the S5 and the Note 4 has a little bit more red color well, whereas this one is washed out. That is the thing with the AMOLED displays because AMOLED displays are very sharp in terms of colors like black is more black, white is more white red is more red so I'm not sure if you can see through camera but Note 4 seems to be very sharp and so as the Galaxy S5 both its devices are extremely sharp absolutely no difference this one is a little bit light you know a little lighter color more orange this one is more red but still both are very sharp it's AMOLED screens that's why then also, as far as this one is concerned, this one is washed out. Of course, it's a non-DFT display. You can also come see it like this. You can see that in this angle, the screen becomes white at specific angles, while Note 4 is very sharp. You can see that course the quad AG screen then we have a 1080p Galaxy S5 you can see a lot of difference there between the AMOLED Samsung devices and the um, TFT devices TFT Samsung devices non AMOLED HD devices of course and same thing will be applied when you use these devices in sunlight you will see that the S5 and the Note 4 will perform better as compared to the Galaxy Grand Prime in terms of you know colors and brightness and stuff like that and brightness actually affects the battery life so you don't have to keep the brightness full on the S5 and the Note 4 in order to see in sunlight that's the best thing about these devices so I uh, just a quick little comparison of screens of both devices be sure to subscribe for Dale Tech videos and I'll see you next one peace